Are you ready? Are you ready? So did you guys know that these plastic water bottles that you buy at your local convenience store not only pose a huge threat to the environment, but also to your health as well? It's true. You see, a recent report by the NRDC, the National Resources Defense Council, announced that many harmful substances are found in these drinking water. Now we're talking about styrene, xylene, and PET, terephthalate. And this is due to all harmful substances from these plastic casing seeping into your drinking water. And this is a process known as leaching. You see, many consumers have this whole misconception that drinking these bottled waters is actually healthier and good for you. But this is just all marketing illusion. The truth is, nearly 30% of the water you buy in your local convenience store is actually just tap water, you know, disguised in these packaging labels from Coca-Cola company or the Pepsi company. They're pretty much the same thing as if you're getting water from your sink. On the plus side, what most people don't realize is that these water bottles aren't strictly regulated by the FDA. And in result, many microbial diseases are found swimming around your water. Now we're talking about Giardia, which caused major diarrhea problem, and E. coli, you know? Do we really want to have that in our drinking water? But what about water in the sports bottle? I mean, is it safe to drink out of these plastic sports bottles as well? Same idea, different result. Some of these sports bottles contains biphenyl A, BPA for short, which is basically this organic molecule that mimics a lot like the female hormone estrogen. Too much of this can lead to obesity and infertility. For females, overconsumptions of BPA can lead to fetuses problems during pregnancy and also breast problems too as well. As for guys, BPA equals prostate cancer. So is tap water good for you? Yeah, actually tap water is recommended. The problem with these purchased water bottle is that it's so distilled that sometimes our body becomes acidic. As a result, our body becomes so deficient in mineral that it leads to multi-mineral deficiency. Let's just back up for a second here. Knowing that tap water is just as good as bottled water, or perhaps even a lot better, then why are we giving these corporate companies more money for something that we can already obtain? I mean, we can already obtain water from our faucets, our sink, our public fountains, and many other places. Well, the answer is convenience. Yeah, it's convenient to have prepared bottled water. But let's be honest here. Does it really take that much effort to fill in your bottle with water? I mean, personally, I find it a lot more convenient to just actually buy a refillable bottle. I mean, it saves money and gas, right? I mean, you don't have to take your car out to Costco and bulk on some water supply. So what are the take-home messages? Well, first of all, eliminate all purchase bottled water. Trust me, you do your body a huge favor. Secondly, when purchasing a sports bottle, Make sure it doesn't have the number 7 on the bottom. This implies that it has BPA, which we do not want. And finally, if you can, and this is probably the best, get yourself a stainless steel water bottle. They're light, they're durable, and on the plus side, they can hold cold and hot drinks as well. So I hope you guys got something out of this video. I know, it's going to take some work. Switching from bottle to tap is going to take some challenge, but trust me, Making small changes can make a huge effect to your health. As again, thanks for watching Living Green with Vince.